What is up, my turtles? My name is Jimmy, also known as Jimmy Tortuga, and welcome back to the Pokemon Sword Turtle Only Run Nuzlocke kind of thing. I hope you guys are enjoying this series. Remember to hit that like button down below. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. Let's get into it. We did some training on everybody. It's just good stuff. Vulcan is, of course, our Turtonator, our Fire Dragon. Everybody is level 12 uh, with Ember, Smog, Tackle, and Protect. I don't think uh, that. We'll just do this quick team recap. Yimage here. Uh, water Gun, Tackle, Bite. Let me go ahead and move Bite above Water Gun. Um, uh, so that's that's very, very good. We got Ivy, our Tertuga, with Aqua Jet, Water Gun, Smackdown, and Protect. Actually, probably one of the best move sets on the team, which is really cool. We got Inferno. Ember Smog Withdraw and Rapid Spin. We'll go ahead and move Rapid Spin probably above Smog, but we'll keep it be uh, below uh, Ember, which is good. Uh, we got Rocky, our Shuckle with Rap Rollout, Withdraw, and just learn Struggle Bug. So I'll put that to the top because uh, Shuckle is, of course, a bug type, which is really, really cool. And then we'll move Rollout in front uh, instead of Rap, so uh, there we go. And. Last but not least, Nico, our uh, Squirtle, uh, with Water Gun, Rapid Spin, Tackle, and Bite. We'll go ahead and move Bite above Rapid Spin, but Water Gun still is better. So that is the team. Uh, Nico's the only one at 13. Actually, Rocky is too, so never mind. Um, but they're in uh, proper order based on uh, the other things and, and whatnot. And I, I swagged out a little bit. I, I, I don't believe I actually changed clothes uh, on, on camera the last time. So that's really, really cool. I hope you guys are excited. We're going to continue on into the wild area. Hop is going to give us our uh, our TM. This is normally, I think, Swift, uh, which it is. So, um, I mean, I'm, I'll, I'll double check to make sure that it is actually Swift. Uh, but I'm I'm fairly uh, I'm fairly confident that is still indeed the case. So let's take a peek. Um, burp, 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 burp. And it is indeed Swift. So. Yeah, unfortunately, we uh, uh, we didn't randomize the TMs like I thought I did, which is a little unfortunate. But I still hope that this uh, this playthrough is still really uh, it would still be very uh, interesting. I said the thing uh, for for everybody. I hope you guys are enjoying this. This is only episode three, so we're still fairly fairly early. We got camping gear now, which is really really cool. Um, and we're gonna try to make our way immediately to Moto Stoke. Uh, we should be able to just kind of go through uh, this really, really quickly. But yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm excited, excited to continue playing this. This is the first time we're able to play this randomized here on the channel, which is super, super cool. I'm still debating if I want to keep the cutscenes in. Um, uh, Moto Stoke is surrounded by a vast wild area. Yeah, I mean. In normal Nuzlocke, we would probably just get an encounter per area, but and, but I, th I think we're good. <laughs> yeah, we'll do camping and all of that fun stuff. So yeah, I'm, I'm excited. I'm excited uh, for for all of this. It's, it's going to be a lot of fun. It's going to be a lot of fun. So I'm curious to see what pops up in the wild area. Uh, I'm very curious to see what pops up in the wild area because it's gonna be It's definitely gonna be a lot of fun It's like because I think it would be really cool to see just a, a Solgaleo just kind of randomly pop up in the air like where the onyx usually is which is really really cool um, Yeah, I'm debating if I want to do any of the raid den adventures, but we'll see we'll see I'm not entirely worried about it at this moment here, so um, this was the first instance too. It's like I remember playing this the first time. Uh, I was I was still trying to get my bearings on YouTube and and figuring out exactly what I want to do. And I, I love this layout a lot more than what I do that one. But that's besides the point. <laughs> um, it's like I think this personally could use some work, but uh, I'll get there. Um, I'm tr I'm still tr I'm still trying to balance you know a bunch of, a bunch of different things. So. It's all of the above. So anyway, the, with the wild area though, this place was massive the first time we went here. It's like, I know everything. It, it's like playing the game as long as I have nowadays. I have over, you know, 1,200 hours in this game. It's like, I know exactly, I, I don't want to say exactly where everything is, but I, it's, I know the area a lot better than when I first started because this was, 
the, the first time we played through this, this, this area was massive. It's like, and the fact that you could do free roaming camera, uh, with, with this, which is, you know, super, super cool, uh, is always funny. That's funny. It's a Larvesta. Usually a big onyx there, and it's a Larvesta. Womp, womp. We got a wingle in the air over there. That's cool. What do we got in the grass? I see something in the grass. I'm not quite sure what they are, though. Uh, oh, it looks like they're Ionicles. That's cool. So, yeah, seeing uh, seeing all of these, um, the, all these, uh, you know, different Pokemon and randomized and all of this above, there's a Decidueye. <laughs> That's a big no for me. So then we got, uh, we got some Watts here. Uh, we got a Hippopotas, which is fine. Uh, I'm not gonna do any raids on screen. Uh, I'm just gonna kinda go through the story and everything. But yeah, it's like this area was massive. And, and then it's like we didn't 100% know what we're gonna do. I don't know what that was. Whoa. Oh, it's glitching through the ground because it's supposed to be in water. But because it's not water, it's glitching out. <laughs> that's funny. Hi, Onyx. That's scary as heck. There's a magmar in the air. That's really funny. <laughs> Is that an Ash Hat Pikachu? Yo, that's dope. It's like the fact that you can have... Yeah, that is definitely a Pikachu. That is really cool, the fact that those are included in the randomizer. Oh my gosh, it's, it's so cool to see this. It's like, and maybe, maybe one of these days, uh, instead of just doing turtle only, um, maybe we'll actually do a full-blown just, you know, randomizer. Maybe even, like, hardcore Nuzlocke or something. That's something I haven't done. I feel like before I do any hardcore versions of any Nuzlocke, I need to kind of perf... I don't want to say perfect, but definitely practice a little bit more. Because I'm, I'm, not, I'm not the best at the Nuzlocking. I'm not, I'm not the best, but, uh, I definitely try my best. It's also early, and I haven't had my, uh, my G Fuel yet, so. It's good, it's good. Also, it's a, it's a new day, but I realized I'm wearing the same shirt. Hashtag totally not planned. <laughs> Sorry. So, it's, it's not a new day, actually. It's, it's, it's just earlier in the day that I started this. <laughs> no, it's, it's, it's a new day. I, I'm just joking, chat. I'm just joking. I mean, comments. I'm such a live streamer. All right, so we're gonna go over here. We're gonna we're gonna get a uh, card. I'm not gonna worry too much about the card. Nobody's gonna get the card anyway. Um, just because again, it's it's a randomizer, and I don't have that. Uh, I don't have this access on the internet, and I'm I'm, I'm good. I'm good with the card, and, and it's good stuff. We got a yamper. So now we got Rotom. Da da da. League card. Here's a sample for you. I got Leon's League card, which is cool. And then we get League cards, Motostoke, heal your Pokemon. I didn't do anything here. But yeah, we're gonna do opening ceremony. I think I am gonna skip the cutscenes. Uh, just because, uh, just because I think that'll be cool. And now that we have everything, I can swap here, so thank goodness. Because I'm, I'm so used to having the Pokemon here, because this is where I swapped it to for shiny hunting, so I'm so used to having it here. And it's like, the fact that you can customize this menu is amazing, but it's like, you can't customize it right away, which is like, <laughs> Um, okay. Um, I think I'm good. Because like I said, we really didn't get into any battles yet. Um, so let's, uh, let us proceed. Um, I'm not, like I said, I'm not overly too concerned about the, uh, the, um, the, 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 the lead card because nobody else is really gonna gonna be using this and uh yeah so sonya's showing around us moto stoke which is really cool but yeah going back well like i said one more time with the wild area it was just so huge and and even so it, it looks like it's uh it, it's so it, it's so good it's like because it's like they took the basis of the wild area made legends arceus as kind of a playground and trial of what is good what isn't good use that as like i said a, a basis of of everything and now, all of a sudden, 
Um, and now all of a sudden we have Generation 9, which is going to be basically the the main, main series Pokemon games. You know, the ones that are the new generation, the start of the new generation um, is going to be... Uh, is going to be basically an entire thing of the of the wild area, which is uh, which is really really cool. I cannot wait for Generation Nine. We're definitely going to be doing. Uh, we'll probably do a Let's Play to start off with that. But I mean, I'm I'm always open to some uh, to some new things. Also, I can finally turn that down a little bit for you guys. Um, I, I always had that on seven rather than um, rather than. Um, Eight because it's 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 a little crazy there. It's a little crazy. It's crazy. But yeah, I mean, Generation Nine is looking to be absolutely incredible. I cannot wait. We got a Miracle Seed. Um, I don't have any Grass type turtles. Sadly, Turtwig was not introduced in this game yet. Uh, Pokemon Home is still not a thing in the in uh, in BDSP. So I don't know. All right, there's Hop. So we're going to talk to Hop, which is cool. So Moto Stoke Stadium. I'm excited. I'm excited for this because we're going to be doing things. Oh, I said I was going to uh, close out uh, movie scenes. So let me go ahead and do that. We'll skip movies. Um, yes. Wait. Wait, yeah, yeah, yeah. Battle effects are on, actually. I, I did that when I was training. Like I said, I just want to do that. I'm at set. Automatic. we got to give nickname. I mean, that's not going to matter anyway. Auto save is off. Casual controls are off. Show nickname. Skip movies is on. Perfect. All right, so we have good settings. Let's get into this. We'll have to choose a number, too. I don't know what number I'm going to use. I don't know what number I'm going to use, my friends. Ah, uh, yes, B. <laughs> like I said, uh, turtle only run. Each uh, each of the turtles have three lives. Um, I'm, I'm a bit pre-recorded, so I still haven't gotten answers for the first question of the day, how you guys felt like that. So bear with me um, as we as we go through there. Um, I don't anticipate us losing, you know, 18 lives. Six times, six Pokemon times three times each is is 18 lives, basically 18 Pokemans. So, yeah. So, yeah, it's uh, it's good stuff. We have to pick a number. I think I got the perfect number. Uh, 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 perfect number, yeah. Uh, uh, fantastic. 024, yeah, let's go. <laughs> I don't know. I don't even care. I don't even care about that. All right, we're gonna head to the hotel. I think we gotta fight. Uh, we gotta fight uh, Marnie to start off this episode. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna see what Marnie has, uh, which is really really cool. Um, and they definitely give you some some guidance here, which is really really cool. All right. So uh, some of the other things I'd like to see from this game uh, um, is just uh, it's just some good. Just some good, uh, uh, some cool Pokemon. Like I said, you saw the Magmar in the air, which is really, really cool. Um, but I definitely, I definitely want to, want to go ahead and mess around with that. Alright. So it's good stuff. We got both registered. So Moto Stoke obviously was one of the cooler places as well. Oh no, we're not going to face Marnie here. We're not, this, this isn't the Marnie fight. This is the Team Skull, uh, or Team Skull. I'm, I've been playing too much. Awesome. Uh, Team, uh, Team Yell. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> this is, this is now Team Skull. Don't worry about it. Don't, don't, don't worry about it. It's fine. It's fine. But you can see Marnie's face in the flags that they did. I never noticed that initially. It's like... Yeah, I never I never noticed that initially. Now, usually these guys have Dark-type Pokemon, but in a randomizer, this guy starts off with a Noibat. Alright. 
So dragon versus dragon, but it's dragon flying. Um, I still am thinking Ember is probably the play, even though it's not going to be super effective. Gust is going to do basically nothing to me. Ember isn't exactly the strongest move uh, in the world, but yeah. Let's see. Let's see what Tackle does. Oh, you butt. I hate confusion hacks. So Noibat is a little bit on the annoying side. So we got Tackle. Yeah, that did a bit more. We definitely need, like, a nice Dragon-type move on Vulcan here. Um, because... Because, I mean, that's... We, we, we could win. We could, we could easily win. Alright, so we're gonna snap out of Confusion right here. Yeah, let's go! Go, Vulcan! And that should take care of the Noibat. So tackling is definitely the play. All right, we'll also have a, another one. Nico to 14, which is really, really cool. Um, yeah, we decided. I, I decided to train a little bit up uh, off screen because I knew, I knew the wild area. It's like Pokemon. We're level 14, 15 in the grass. So yeah, I don't know who's staring at us in the back, but yeah. Like I said, I never Nincada. Well, rip. I never noticed uh, that Marnie's face was on the flags when I first started the game. Obviously, I know now um, and know much, <laughs> like, way, way later. I, I noticed that when I first played the game, I never noticed that. Like, I never made the connection. It's like, oh, they're they're holding somebody's face. And then when she comes in here in, in just a moment, it's like, wait, you're you're here? It's like, never never made that connection. Never made that connection. Oh, there's other uh, uh, gym gym challengers. All right, so now we're gonna beat these two with uh, with Hop's help, which is really cool. Sneaking in some Pokemon battles. I mean, I didn't entirely mean to, but yeah. All right, we got a Hoot Hoot and a Zubat. We're not doing very well with Pokemon. I got Vulcan and Gossifleur. I mean, Gossifleur is not really great in this area here. Um, so, I think I'm just gonna Ember, probably just take out the Zubat. Yeah. Zubat's gonna use Astonish into Gossifleur, which is fine. Hoot Hoot is gonna use Confusion into Gossifleur. You can take the hits all you want. Oh, and it gets confused. No! Alright, Vulcan is gonna use Ember into the Zubat. Gonna do eh, about half. And Gossifleur uses Rapid Spin into the Hoot Hoot. Cool. Fantastic. And now Gossifleur is a little faster. All right, we're going to do the same play and just Ember into the Zubat. Zubat is obviously faster. That one into me this time. Hoot Hoot Confusion. Now they're going to double into me. That's fine. I'm tanky as heck. And then Rapid Spin. And because of the speed boosts is why uh, Gossifleur is getting a, a little faster than, than me. We get the burn off, which is cool. I don't think the burn knocks it out here, which is fine. I do not have rapid spin. Um, let's just, uh, let's Ember the Hoot Hoot. Uh, Zubat's gonna go first anyway. Um, I thought the uh, Zubat was gonna do that. Absorb. Oh, uh, I mean, one HP, does that, does that keep it alive? Hoot Hoot is gonna use tackle into me. Does that keep it alive, though, that absorb? I don't know. Hoot Hoot goes down. So these guys were not too challenging. That Yeah, that one HP kept it alive. You butt. <laughs> I mean, it's probably going to go down to rapid spin here, but... Alright, cool. So, relatively easy set of battles here. Hopefully the next set of randomized Pokemon are more... Uh, are more entertaining and interesting. I said the thing again. But, uh, yeah. So, basically at this point, uh, for the most part, is... Is all good. And like I said, I never noticed that Marnie's face was on their flags when I first started. When I first started playing this game. Never noticed that, for whatever reason. 
For whatever reason, I never noticed that. It's it's definitely it's definitely something. All right, so let's finish up Moto Stoke here. I think I'll finish the episode uh, right before our fight with Hop. Uh, he's pla pra practicing his fastball. I can talk. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. All right, so cool. He's he's practicing his fa fastball. All right, so we got to go back to the stadium. Uh, this is actually Moto Stoke, uh, Moto Stoke Stadium. So this is where Kabu is. Kabu, I believe that's uh, that's correct. So cool. We're gonna skip the gym. Uh, like I said, the gym, uh, the the cutscene here. Um, so. So we're, we're going to get changed. I still really wish we could have customized this a little bit more. This is something that I feel that they... Uh, that they failed on, I guess you can say. Is, is the lack of being able to customize your official uniform. I mean, I kind of get why they did it, but at the same time, it's like, it just... It would have been a lot cooler if you were able to wear even, like, a different variation of the uniform. You know, wear your favorite typing and, and whatnot. So, yeah. There's Chairman Rose. And Leon. Very cool. Yeah, I, I, I think I'll, I'll finish up this episode with uh, with the fight versus hop here. Like I said, ba basically, uh, I'm, I'm going through this game... As a, if you haven't seen this game, first and foremost, I have a full Let's Play on it on the channel. Please go check that out. Um, uh, I also have some other, you know, the Egg Cage Lock with Soy, uh, the Shiny Lock. Uh, well, that didn't finish, but I got other things if you want to see the story. This one, we're just, we're plowing through. This this isn't meant to be a super long series. Um, I'm just, uh, I'm, I'm just going to go go through these really, really... Uh, relatively, really, really quickly, uh, while, while still trying to keep them, uh, you know, on, uh, at, at 30 minutes, uh, ish each. So, that's, that's very cool. So, alright, we got a fight hop here. Uh, I think I'm, I think I'm pretty well set. Uh, I got, you know, Turtonator, uh, going. We haven't lost any lives yet. I, I, I don't see us losing lives really anytime soon. Alright, so let's go ahead and fight Hop here to finish up this episode of the Turtle Only Run. What do you got this time, Hop? Because I know you change. We send out a Nicket. He also has six Pokemon now, so I uh, didn't think that through, but it's fine. Nicket is not going to be too much of a burden. Um, or maybe it'll be unburden. I don't know. That's its usual ability. It's, it's on par with the team, so training is definitely... Definitely the way to go. Use a Snarl, which lowers my special attack. So that is that is definitely something. You know, good play by by Hop here. I don't think I really have a good way to fight Dark type Pokemon just yet. Um, I mean, I could Struggle Bug with Rocky. Um, not sure, honestly. Not sure. Ah, friggin'. Um, let's let's go ahead and tackle. All right. So special attack is minus two. Yeah, Nick, it's gonna be a lot more of a problem than I thought it was gonna be. Tail whip is gonna lower my defense, but you haven't shown me a physical move yet. I'm fairly confident Snarl is not a physical move. Okay. Tail Whip, I'm now minus two defense, which is kind of scary. Not gonna lie. All right, so as I'm continuously playing the game, uh, I'm definitely finding, yeah, it must be physical. Oh, that was a crit. I was like, it must be physical if it did that much damage. It was a crit, that's why. Um, I'm finding weaknesses of, of the team, and I definitely need to, uh, I definitely need to find ways to deal with a couple, oh, you butt, he also used a potion. Uh, 
Um, I definitely need to find different ways to deal with, uh, with dark types specifically. Water types are, a, are kind of a pain in the butt. Because I do not have really, really any good ways to deal with water types. Um, and yeah, that's, that's about, that's about it. I mean, I definitely, I'll definitely need to heal again too. It's like, he's definitely doing a lot more damage to me than I am to him. Alright, well, I wasn't expecting this first Pokemon to be a bot. I just don't know what else I'd do with it. I mean, I guess I could go into Ivy and Aqua Jet, Home Claws. Okay. Doesn't that boost its chance for crit, too? It's attack and accuracy, Rose. <sighs> well, the thing is, I'm also on set battle style, so... <laughs> I'm trying to make this uh, entertaining, but it's, I have no easy way to hit this, so. All right, so I definitely am switching out after this regardless of what happens. So goodbye, Nickit. You are a pain in the butt. I don't have easy ways to deal with you. Vulcan grows to 13, which is cool. Sends out of your mask. Okay, I do have things to deal with this thing. All right, so we can go right into Yimage. Should be fine. I do have something to deal with you. Because you, I do believe, are Ghost and maybe even Ghost Ground. Nightshade, that'll do 12 HP. So that actually hurts a lot. Um, but we should be able to bite, and that's super effective. Dang, these things are tanky. And I flinch it, which is good. Night, uh, if I get another Nightshade, though, that's going to... Hurt. Flinch again would be nice. Yeah! Let's go! Let's go, Yimage! <laughs> Uses Protect. Okay. Okay, I see. I see you there. I see you. Let's go, Yimage, though. Let's go. <laughs> Getting that double flinching and yeah. So I know he normally does not have six Pokemon here. It's too early in the game to have six Pokemon. So I definitely did hit that button. <laughs> so that's good. And then a Wimpod. Okay. So that's a water type as well as a bug. So I think I'm pretty safe to could just continue biting it. Use a struggle bug. Okay. That lowers my special attack. That's fine. Okay. Um, I kind of feel like I should do something else. I mean, I got Smackdown. That that would work. Who's in Struggle Bug? Yeah, let's go into Ivy. Let's go into Ivy. Then we got As One. I, I still can't believe it has As One. That's absolutely crazy. Defense Curl. So it actually might survive this now. I know, I know Ivy is not the fastest thing ever. I, I do not have a fast team. So, Sand Attack, your butt. So, let's see if I hit this Smackdown. I do. Uh, that Defense Curl saving you. That Defense Curl is definitely saving you. And then Struggle Bug. Ow. I think I'm just pure Water type right now, so... That's why that's, uh you know, very effective, or, or it's a neutral hit, it's not very effective. I need you to hit the smackdown, please, Ivy. Thank you. Yeah, this is, this is definitely also going to be a challenge. My team is not very fast, so I got Chilling Ray, which the attack rise, oh my gosh. Image to 13, Rocky, Ivy to 13, oh my gosh. L gym. Okay. Okay, that's a psychic type. I think I'm gonna Aqua Jet. Especially with the Attack Rise. Yeah. Let's Aqua Jet. Hopefully not miss. Thank you. With the Attack Boost. Dang, this thing is tanky. These things are tanky. Confusion, and I lose my first life. This thing is also strong. Alright, so I lose my first life, which is... No bueno. 
Um, I'm gonna go into my trump card. We're gonna go into Nico. And we're gonna bite. Well, here's the other problem, too. I'm also using special attackers with physical moves. <laughs> so, that, that also is not good. <laughs> Alright, well, it's too bad that I'm losing a life very early on here. Um, wants to learn to move water pulse? Yes, please. Um, I'll, I'll do that over tackle. Water pulse is actually huge right now. Okay, uh, Rog and Rolla, which is a rock type, so learning Water Pulse immediately is is definitely kind of funny. So we're good there. Sorry for a little bit longer episode, uh, you you guys. My turtles here. All right, so I just got to be careful. I'm down to I'm down to two lives on Ivy, which kind of sucks. That I was kind of scared. That I that that that's kind of how that happened. So we got we got Snow Run, which I believe is a ice type. I'm not sure if it's any other typing, but we're gonna water pulse it anyway. Cause this doesn't do that. He's got such a tanky team. And he's got leftovers. He's got such a tanky team. Like these things are not taking damage. And of course he's got double team. Ah! So if I miss, that's going to be... That is a heck of a strategy. Not going to lie. That is a heck of a strategy. Alright, so I just need to hit these water pulses. Apparently it's faster. And the more it uses double team, the more I'm not going to be able to hit it. I need like something like swift. Or a crit here would be nice. No. I need this to hit, and I kind of feel also I need it to crit. I need this to hit, and I feel like it also needs to crit. Come on, Nico. You can do it, Nico. Yeah! Let's go! Screw your double teams, Hop! <laughs> Screw your double teams! <laughs> Alright. We get 14 to Vulcan, and we defeat Pokemon Trainer Hop, so... Um, unfortunately, just, you know, my the other problem is, is especially defensive. Not all the greatest there, but that's gonna do it for this episode of the Pokemon Sword uh, Turtle Only Run. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, I gotta go heal the team, and uh, I'll try to figure out what I'm gonna do next, but uh, hit that like button down below, subscribe to the channel if you are new, and I will catch you in the next one. Take care, everybody!